a good morning friends and welcome to crazy r my name is nandish and today i will show you how you can create your own wallpaper setter app using koodler which will set your android phones wallpaper using our app so let's get started so friends here we have opened the koodler window so here we will click on the create apps button like this then we will click on the create project button and our project name will be wallpaper setter app like this then click on next click on finish to we'll get the things ready and if we we'll do all the things right it will show us a new window like this so first thing we need to do is go to the settings and change our app name as wall paper setter and then close this then scroll down in the screen one properties and give the title of the screen one as wallpaper setter and make sure you make it scrollable and then here you need a component called wallpaper search for it in the palette and drag and drop it then close this and over here we will drag and drop one image component and make it width as fill parent and height will be automatic and we will drag and drop one button which will be font bold and font italic and the font size of it will be 19 and width will be fill parent we will scroll down and with the text at set wallpaper and scroll up and give the background color at some what this click on set and then we will upload here one image so go to image one click on upload file now here i have some wallpapers this is wallpaper one like this and wallpaper two I will drag and drop these both in the assets manager of Koodler. First, I will drag and drop the wallpaper one like this. It takes some time to upload, and here's our wallpaper one. Now I will drag and drop the second one, wallpaper two dot png, like this, and then our wallpaper two is also uploaded. To the corner, so I'll close this, and I will change the picture to wallpaper one. Okay. Now over here, I will make it scale picture to fit like this. And over here, we need one more image button. Means one image and one button. So we will drag and drop one image below the the. button offset wallpaper and then we will make its width fill parent and scale picture to fit and the picture will be wallpaper 2 like this now we will drag and drop your same button like the button one so i will copy the button one we we'll scroll up and right click on set wallpaper button and copy it scroll down paste it by control v like this so the ui of our app is almost done now over here we will code our app we have all the components which we need like image we have two images and two buttons and one wallpaper and wallpaper one we set our wallpaper of our android device So friends the UI of our app is done now we need to code it so go to the block section scroll down and click on button 1 drag and drop this one which says win button 1 dot click go to wallpaper 
and scroll down and drag and drop this one called wallpaper one dot set wallpaper image. Now he he will write the file name of our wallpaper one. So it is wallpaper underscore one dot png. So I will drag and drop here one text block and write here wallpaper underscore one dot png. Now we will duplicate this blog like this and change this to button one dot copy and this one as wallpaper two dot png. It's really very simple. So now both things are done. UI is also done and coding is also done. Now we will test this app on our Android phone. So first we will e export our app in a tiki format. So click on export. Click on Android app.apk. It will save the project and then it will start exporting our app. So, friends, now it is almost done. Now it will show us a QR code. See, this is the QR code which we will scan on our Android phone to install our app. So here's my phone screen. So friends, we are scanning that QR code on our Android device using Google Lens. So we will tap on the shutter button and then we will click on the website button like this. Then the download will start. Click on download anyway. Then click on open. Then click on install. Which will install our app. Then you will click on the open button like this. So currently our app has two wallpapers. This is the second one. And this is my current wall wallpaper which I am currently using. So now, here's our app. Now we will test our app. So first we will click on the first wall wallpapers below set wallpaper button. Like this. And see, the wallpaper has been changed. And now we will click on the second wallpapers down button. That's the change. So it's a pretty basic app but very important. So friends, that was the video for today. Where I showed you how you can create your own wallpaper setter app using Kuduler. You can also add more wallpapers and buttons in this app. And check it. So that was the video for today. If you have liked the video, like the video, share the video and subscribe to my channel Crazy Art and click on the bell icon to get more videos like this. Until that time you get the next video. Bye bye.